Hello, fair explorers of the internet. Whether you've stumbled upon this video yourself or somebody has shared it to you, welcome. My name is Michael. So, to start this off, A is 2015. What? What? Where did 2014 go? I don't understand. And anyways, it's been like two weeks of 2014 or 2015. Two weeks of 2015 already, and that's fun. It feels like 2014 still. I already failed like three of my uh, resolutions. This would be one of them. I meant to do this last week. That never happened. So a lot of my New Year's resolutions I haven't really kept up with because of distractions. I get distracted fairly easily because I'm a human and I get curious. But the thing is, a lot of these distractions that have kept 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 me from doing what I want uh, is were, were things that were out of my control. So these New Year's resolutions that I had that uh, I broke very very fast were broken because I got distracted by various things, be it the fact that it didn't feel like 2015 yet, or because of things that were out of my control. That was That's the big thing, things that are out of my control. So there are some days where I'm actually motivated to do things. I know, strange, right? Generally it's just kind of like that motivation that you get to change your life at 11.45 p.m. Well, that's what I was getting in the day, which was great. I actually felt like doing things. I knew what I was gonna do. I was gonna do things, and then things happened and I couldn't. For instance, going grocery shopping for three hours. I can't help it. I, I don't, I can't drive myself anywhere. I don't have a person. I do have a person. So a lot of these distractions that cause me to not be able to do what I'm motivated to do are out of my control and because of that I just don't I can't I can't do anything about it and I just waste my motivation. I'm so I'm so motivated to do everything that day, specifically like today, I was so motivated, I was like, yes, this, the lighting is good, my face doesn't look like things just exploded out of it and I feel like I could actually do a thing and make it good and I was gonna do that and I was sitting there doing my thing like I always do watching YouTube for all of the days and then I was told oh hey we're going grocery shopping I was like really okay thanks for telling me now and we're leaving in half an hour great so I get home three hours later and the lighting is now really bad because it's basically sunset because it's winter time and leaving at 12 means that whenever you get home, it is going to be at least like sunset. So then I just do my own thing and now it's six o'clock and I'm trying to do this and it is like pitch black out because it's winter time and winter time is actually nice because there's no spiders outside. So when I have one of these days where I'm like super motivated to do everything imaginable, I generally can't because the universe. And so basically what happens is by the end of the day, when I've done nothing productive at all, I'm just sitting there and like, why couldn't I have done those things? Basically what happens next is that I'm on the computer for the rest of the night thinking I could have done things with my day. And guess what? I didn't. So then I'm thinking, Tomorrow, I'll be motivated, I can do all these things, I plan out my day for everything I'm gonna do, and then the next day comes, the sun rises, I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna do things, today is the day I will get things done, nothing happens. Because that's every day of my life. Motivation! Not gonna use this motivation. So trying to bring this back to the original topic of distractions, all of my loss of motivation is always caused by some form of distraction that I generally don't control. Whether it's starting to accidentally binge watch some YouTube or playing a game for longer than I expected, or having to go grocery shopping for three hours, I can't control these things. Technically I can, but it's not happening. It's just not. And 
that's the point where I'm like, oh, I can't deal with these things. Sucks to be me. Well, that video went pretty much nowhere. I kind of went forwards and then veered off and came back. Technically, that's going somewhere, but oh well. Um, I mean, first video of the year, trying to get myself back into it. I haven't made videos since August, but I'm trying to get back back on track while I still can. Um, would you not? Well, that was a very distracting video because I distract myself so many times throughout this, and I just need to get back on track, which is probably the best way for me to, or anyone really, to get through their distractions is have sort of like a, a plan and know what you're doing and don't let other things interfere with your plan unless it's like someone just died then that's probably going to interfere with your plans but other than that or unless a tornado comes through just don't don't let anything distract you just do what you have to do you'll know, get it done you'll feel so good afterwards and that's what i need to do and this is generally the pep talk I have at 11.45 at night, and then I f wake up the next morning and don't remember any of it. Anyways, trying to bring this to a close and then just having it go off somewhere again. Thank you so much for watching. That wasn't much, but it was a thing. And it's now a thing that you just wasted, or not wasted, you didn't waste time, right? You were not distracted by this. You probably were. Um, stop procrastinating. That's more of a message to myself rather than you because you probably did your things. Maybe. I don't know. Did you do your things? Tell me in the comments below. Anyways, like this video if you liked it because it does actually mean a lot that you took the time to press a button. Not many people do that. And if you want to be alerted every time I make a video from now on, hopefully I won't get distracted every week and not make a video then hit the subscribe button, because that makes me so happy as well. And that's about it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you hopefully next week. Bye-bye.